We have reached Jeff and Jackie at their hotel room in South Korea. Thank you so much. And I want to say you're speaking to us at midnight, your time in South Korea. So really, thanks very much for doing this. Oh, no problem. <laughs> so Jeff and Jackie, what kind of an experience has this been so far? Uh, uh, I think we're still trying to grasp with it. Uh, we always knew that there wasn't a possibility of doing so well in a team event. Uh, they're a very experienced team, uh, so they knew exactly what to expect. And uh, yeah, they went at one goal in mind, and that was the gold medal. And they did that in style. Now, you guys were in the stands watching Caitlin in that team competition. What was going through your mind during that routine? Were you Jackie skating every step with her? Yeah, I think I skate almost every step with every one of those skaters now. We've watched them um, so for so many years and so many different competitions that we almost know all the skaters like we know our own. So yeah, watching her and watching the other skaters was, um, it was very exciting and, and nerving and um, we're very proud of all of them for sure. How big a thrill was it to see that gold medal go right around Caitlin's neck? You better talk. <laughs> it's, it's very emotional, yeah. To actually see the, the pre-medal ceremony down at the rink level is one thing, but uh, to actually get up uh, in the mountains where the uh, medal plaza is and just seeing everyone else receiving their medals and then you see your own daughter go up uh, with a team to uh, actually accept a gold medal. It's, uh, yeah, it's, it's really hard to describe. Uh, but it, yeah, it's probably an experience that we'll be thinking about for a long time. Uh, and, and yeah. then to watch our anthem play as well, it's, it's very overwhelming. Uh, I know that the athletes like Caitlin are uh, pretty isolated from distractions during competition, but have you guys had a chance to have any time with her? Yes, we did, actually. We got to see her this evening, so that was very nice. And how was she? <laughs> She's fantastic. She's uh, she's happy and she's healthy and she's on the ball and ready to get going for next week. <laughs> now the um, there's a bit of time between the mm -hmm. team competition and next week. How does she keep the momentum going? How how, how difficult is that? Well, what the uh, a lot of the ice dancers and uh, ladies skaters have all left uh, the Olympic Village. Uh, they're all presently in Seoul now, just about a three-hour drive away from the Olympic Games. Uh, so the distraction of the Games itself is, well, I guess the everyday distraction of the Games is gone. Uh, but now they're able to take advantage of some extra ice time for training and just trying to get things back to normal again before they head back in to compete. I know there's been a lot of support expressed from Marystown. They did a video for her. Uh, has she looked at that? And does she have any kind of lucky charm or some routine that, that she feels brings her luck? She doesn't uh, do a lot of social media, especially the day of the event. Uh, but we were able to get, get her to show, uh, see the video, and she was very appreciative of it. Um, she re realizes how much support she has back in Newfoundland, and and uh, she says very overwhelming. If, if she has any um, superstitions or anything like that, I think she just keeps them to herself and does what she has to do to get herself ready. She <laughs> sure looks determined out there. And just as a final question, Mom and Dad, uh, you've got another week to go. How nerve-wracking is all of this for you both? Um, <laughs> if you catch us in the stands during competition, it's... Um, it's written all over our faces. It is quite nerve wracking um, because we just want her to skate well. We want her to be happy and, and uh, do the best she can do. Well, thank you, Jeff and Jackie, for joining us. As I say, it's uh, after midnight where you are. And of course, you know that uh, Caitlin has wished the very best. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you very much.